Hello, this is Ami Diamond. In this episode, I'd like to show you uh, an issue that I saw in the social media. Uh, when you move and copy uh, documents or folders, you don't always see uh, the site or the library that you're looking for. So I, I just created now uh, a new uh, team site, which is called Happy Days. And I have a document library, which is called uh, Documents. And I'm currently in another site and I want to move all of the documents that are in demo 1960 to the happy days uh, uh, library um, so if I'm in this uh, document library I have a folder which is called folder one with two documents and I want to move the, the folder so actually I can uh, mark it and go and say uh, let's do copy we can do copy or move and as you see here i i see uh, the libraries that i have on the site i can also see other libraries and here i can see other uh, uh, team sites that are uh, existing but I, I i cannot find the happy days i can also click on more places but still, here it shows only the recent ones. I don't see it under recent. I cannot also see it under your teams, even if I do control. So I cannot find it and it's actually uh, not that nice. So actually, what is the workaround or what is the proper way to do things? So here comes, I'll go to the new site. And in each document library, I can pin to quick access. I can also add a shortcut to OneDrive, but in this case, uh, we can pin to quick access. Once we do that, we see that it's pinned. We don't see anything here. What happens actually, now if we go uh, to this uh, source document and we will try to move a copy, I'll do uh, copy. Now we will see um, the happy days in the quick access. So no matter where I am in the tenant, I see it. So I can choose this and actually I can say, okay, I'm gonna copy uh, this folder one to this document library. By the way, I could also have I moved it to another uh, library on the site. We see here the folder one. And now uh, the other way, uh, which is uh, not that recommended, but it's also I saw in an, uh, that was recommended was to um, add the shortcut to OneDrive. So let's go to to this document library and we could add the shortcut to OneDrive. <coughs> then it's added. And now when we try to move it, we first need to go to OneDrive. Um, <coughs> let's do that, let's do a copy. So here, instead of looking it in the quick access, I need to go to my files and look for this uh, shared document and now actually I can copy it, but uh, the quick access is much uh, easier. Let's see what happens. So within here, I need to refresh. We should see it. So uh, we have two possibilities. Uh, one is add to the quick access and the other is add to shortcut to OneDrive. Now if we want to remove it, uh, by the way, we can go now to the OneDrive and we can actually uh, decide if to remove um, it. You see this thing? If I click on unpin the, from quick access, it will now uh, disappear. And uh, by the way, if I want to uh, remove the, the Add to SharePoint, I can actually add uh, to OneDrive, I can mark it and do remove, and now it will remove that. So, um, this is the tip I give you. 
uh, try it and hopefully it will give you some productivity. Goodbye.